Hi guys, so I just unpacked this camera as you saw and I'm like looking at the viewfinder. Um, I, yeah, I just thought I wanted to start doing little vlogs here and there and taking better photos for Insta and stuff like that. So welcome to my first vlog. I am going to show you guys a few days in my life. Um, and I thought I would start it now because I'm actually wearing makeup, which I never do. So, take a little screenshot of this or whatever because I never wear makeup. Um, yeah, so in a little, I am going to get drinks with a friend. Um, outside, of course, in New York, um, being safe. And I will check back in with you in a second. And yeah, welcome. Okay, I'm not the best at doing my nails, but I just finished them. Um, and I used the color Essie Limousine. Um, I don't know if it's gonna focus, but Essie Limousine is the color that I used. Um, just like a simple, like pink-ish, white-ish color. Um, I've been doing my own nails all of quarantine because I'm just not comfortable yet going to a nail salon. So, um, yeah, I've just gotten a little bit better at doing them myself, but I could definitely use a manicure sometime soon. And definitely a pedicure because it's like been too long. But not comfortable yet going in New York just because obviously it's like not something that I need it's not essential so doing my own nails for now is the move um, and of course I'm late to get drinks so I am going to put my shoes on and get out the door <laughs> huh so this is what I really look like um I have a fat pimple forming right now so <laughs> I have pimple cream on, um, but that was so fun. Just drinks with my girlfriends who I haven't seen in a few weeks. And um, we went to this little cute bar slash restaurant place in the village, which I highly recommend. Um, yeah, everything was great. So I'll see you guys in the morning. Um, pretty busy day tomorrow. We are recording an episode of Ageless, so I will take you along on all of that. Hello, good morning guys. Um, I just took a cold shower. I heard, um, I think it was on the Skinny Confidential, um, which is one of my favorite podcasts, about how great cold showers are in the morning, especially like if I'm tired or whatever. I love just like jumping in a quick cold shower. So I just got out, my skin feels super dry because I did like that acne drying stuff last night. So I'm gonna do a little bit of skincare. I'm gonna start out with um, this stuff from, little focus. This is the Sunday Riley UFO um, with salicylic acid treatment. So I've been doing this definitely this stuff is pretty drying as well, but for that mask me, I feel like I need it. So that's step one. And I know you're like not supposed to put the dropper on your face, but 
I like hold it maybe a millimeter away from my face and then put it on. Okay. Next, I am going in with the, I don't know how to say this, Augustinus Bader, the Rich Cream. This stuff is major. Definitely a pricier face cream, but for myself who has extremely dry skin and eczema, it is 100% worth it. So I'm just gonna put this on top because the salicylic acid tends to dry my skin out, the Sunday Riley one, so going to do this. Okay. I'm going to do SPF, but I'm going to let this sink in for a second and make my coffee and get dressed. I will show you guys all of that, but um, I know I'm going to be on camera a little bit because we're recording at 11 a.m. the podcast and um, so I need to look a little bit presentable. Sorry, there's something in my eye. <laughs> um, I think a little bit of the UFO serum got in my eye. That stuff is major, but it does burn if it gets in your eyes. Oh my god, I look so pale right now. Okay, see you in a bit. I started adding Trader Joe's cold brew to my espresso shots so yeah now I'm like addicted to this combo it's so good in the morning like I need a super strong coffee in the morning now and I'm so addicted to this stuff it's amazing so try this I am back in my bathroom. I'm dressed, as you can see. Um, and I am going to do, just finish up um, my skincare slash makeup situation. I'm just gonna put on a little bit of concealer because honestly, my eye bags are coming back. If you don't know, I get filler under my eyes because, um, when I lost weight, my eye bags just got super, super bad because obviously if you like lose a lot of volume in your face, um, your eye bags become more prominent. So I get filler under my eyes um, every few months and it's completely metabolized now pretty much. So I'm like queen of mascara and need to cover up the mask knee that is just so not cute and I honestly don't know what is up with that because I wash my masks all the time. Wow, this concealer is like very not my color. Um, it's the Urban Decay one but it's kind of like orange so I also have this L'Oreal full wear one, um, which I feel like is more of my color right now. So we're gonna do a little bit of that. And honestly, just like, rub that in with a damp beauty blender. Give it me right here.
that's all pretty much blended in. I'm going in with this super goop. Um, this is their SPF. It is the smooth and poreless 100% mineral matte sunscreen. It's a little bit like it comes out of the bottle tinted, but then once it's on my face, I can't really see it anymore. So um, I don't know what's good with that, but I like putting it on um, over my concealer because I feel like it just like helps blend everything in. And obviously I'm like so obsessed with wearing SPF every day because I know I'm gonna get wrinkly AF early because my skin is so dry. So I'm like always on my SPF grind, especially, and I feel like people always forget this, whenever I'm driving, I make sure that there's SPF on the top of my hands because pro tip when you're driving and your hands are on the steering wheel, they are getting totally roasted by the sun. And people say the neck and the hands is how you tell someone's true age because everyone has Botox and filler in their face. So, okay, then I'm gonna go in with a little bit of bronzer. This is the L'Oreal bronzer. Um, bronze, please, in the color La Terra. And I literally put this like all over my face just to set it. to brush the brows. Curl the lashes quickly. And I'm just going to end off with a little bit of mascara. I'm just leaving the studio now. That was such a great episode. Um, it was with Imagine It Done, who um, Lisa Jacobs is the founder and it's a professional organizing service, which is so cool. And just like, I'm such an organization person and like list person. So I totally vibed with her um, and I can't wait for that episode. But I'm leaving now and the fabric thing that I was showing you guys is um, I, if you don't follow me on Instagram, I post like a lot of food photos and when I do those, 
recipes, um, I like to do like different backgrounds and stuff, so it's nice to have different um, pieces of fabric to like lay down and shoot um, recipes on. So it kind of like changes up the feed rather than just having all white. So yeah, that was great. I have everything in this bag. Um, I will see you in a bit. I'm just walking home now. Okay, I am home now. Um, and I have a call in about an hour, but I'm gonna try and squeeze in a quick workout. Um, I'll show you guys what I'm doing. I think I might do Mad Fit, um, which is one of my favorite YouTubers um, for workouts and stuff like that. So, I'm gonna get ready and BRB. <laughs> Oh my God, can you see how much I'm sweating? That was so good. I ended up doing um, 30 minute butt and thighs boot camp workout with Sydney Cummings. Um, and I mostly was using 20, 15 to 25 pound weight. So amazing. I'm gonna do a little walk on the treadmill and then that'll be it. That was like a perfect, 30 minute booty heavyweight workout. So exactly what I needed. Okay, done with my call. I, does anyone else still wear these headphones? When, especially like for calls, I hate doing the AirPods. I just feel like those are so much better. Um, but I'm kind of hungry right now, so I'm gonna go make a snack. Still in my workout stuff. Um, need to shower and everything still, but hungry, gonna go make a snack, and we'll check in in a bit. Hello guys, so I am actually going back to the same little um, cafe bar that I went to last night with my girlfriends. We're going back again tonight just because it was so cute, such a fun vibe and um, all outdoor seating obviously. Um, it's called Bar Pisolino, I believe um, and it's in the West Village. Super cute, highly recommend if you are in the area. Um, but before I do that, I wanted to show you guys, um, I'm going to do a little bit of a um, meal prep and prep some veggies for the next few days, for this week, and I wanted to show you what I'm doing, so. Okay, so we have a huge bag of Brussels sprouts. Um, another little bag, some cauliflower, broccoli, and coconut oil. And um, I have two pans right here, already greased with coconut oil. The oven is on 450. So I'm gonna chop these up and um, throw them in the oven for about 45 minutes probably. And um, we'll see how that works. Okay, 
these are all chopped and done now um, here's where you might want to add flavorings like coconut aminos tahini um, soy sauce whatever you like on your veggies but I just like to keep them plain when I'm meal prepping because then I can create different flavor profiles depending on the meal I'm eating them with. So these are gonna go in the oven for about 45 minutes. I'm gonna go shower and I will check back in in a moment. Finally in bed. It's like 10 30 and I'm literally exhausted. Um ugh, I hate that my skin is like not super clear right now. I just feel like with my eczema and then like wearing a mask all the time, my skin is just freaking out. So I'm really going to work on finding a routine that works. For me in the next few weeks, um, cause this ain't it. I'm like not down for this. Um, yeah, anyway, I had dinner at home. I ate a bunch of those veggies that I prepped earlier. Um, ate dinner with the fam at home and now I'm gonna scroll on TikTok for probably hours and try to get to bed pretty early um i think i'm gonna end off the video here but i loved vlogging over the past few days and there will be more to come so follow me on instagram and i guess subscribe to me here now and there will be more vlogs to come love you guys and peace